What's up, dog? Taking a little snooze. Another snooze. We, that's right, got another box. It's rather potato, though. Tall and skinny, just like me. So you know it's not shoes, but something else you might be interested in. About a week ago, Adidas released their new Audi color line of track suits, track pants, shirts, hoodies, all kinds of things. Being as that I do enjoy a good track pant, especially the way it looks with my shoes and my thin frame. What can I say, skinny is in. I ordered some. So today let's talk about two of those pairs. First up is an SST track pant. According to Adidas, inspired by the Adidas Superstar shoe, the SST tracksuit was designed in 1979 for tennis training. I was one years old. It was made with the signature sheen of tricot fabric and quickly became an iconic Adidas street style. These men's track pants stay true to the original. A slim fit and tapered leg give these pants a modern look. Finished with a small contrast embroidered trefoil logo on the hip and classic three stripes down the leg. So which ones did I get? Got me some sweet baby blue, son. This would be called an unbagging. I gotta bag it up. Bag it up. I like the way you work it. Uh, da -dee -da. That didn't work. Since we're dealing with pants now, let's talk a little bit about fitting. I'm about five foot 10, weigh about 145 pounds. When I order Adidas track pants, I actually have to wear a size small. I truly think that they size these for like basketball players. So if I ordered a medium, which is the size I normally wear in a lot of things, it's like really long. And I don't want to have to cuff or bunch up my track pants. I want it to be nice and tailored fit, almost an Italian fit. So for me to get that really snug look and to get a nice uh, silhouette, carrot silhouette, I go for a size small. So here we go. Never done like a pant video before. Never done a fashion haul as they say. Here we go, baby blue and on the bottom, it's cuffed. Looks like that. Standard three stripes running down the leg. Your pocket has a zipper, which you can unzip. Give you a peek inside the pocket. Doesn't quite have that same smell as a Adidas Ultra Boost or a Boost of some sort. There is no back pocket. You wanna see the laces, Playa? Here are the laces rings, whatever they want to call them. The aglets, like these are just normal. And then we'll just show you the logo. There you go. As I mentioned, size small. They retail for $65 online. Why did I get baby blue? I love auctions. When something fits me, I tend to buy a number of that type of thing in different colors because I know it's going to work. So in track pants, I have red, blue, maroon, white, black. If you like track pants, you probably have a number of them. Jogger pants, if you will. They're not sweatpants. Sweatpants are very different. Plus, won't these go really well with my blue tint Yeezys? Too much blue? Not enough blue? All right, what can I say? Navy blue is my power color, so this would be my Fortress of Solitude color. Next up is an Adidas BB track pant. Why is it called BB? It actually doesn't say on the website, but on the tag it says Beckenbauer. Beckenbauer? About right. Beckenbauer. According to adidas.com, the first Adidas tracksuit debuted in 1967 and revolutionized a shoe company. Today's version remasters the archival legend. These men's track pants have a slim fit and modern tapered leg. Retro pin tuck details feature on the waist. Finished with an embroidered contrast trefoil logo on the hip and iconic three stripes down the leg. Let's unbag it. Time to go potato chip style. You might want to adjust your contrast. Bam! Oh, oh, yellow. Look, I don't know if you can tell, these are yellow, yellow, like yellow. All right, I think these are gonna fit me the best. I love them. Let's look at the feet first. They don't have a cuff at the bottom, but they are tapered. That's hot, I dig it, stretchy. Like the other pair, this has a zipper pockets. Unlike the other pair, however, this one has a back pocket. There is no zipper on the back pocket. And it has not a pleat, but it has this oh-so-fashionable line that runs down. Mm. Three stripes running down from the waist to the leg. Laces, strings that match the color, aglets. Again, small, there's your tag. Beckenbauer, these retailed for $70 online. As I mentioned before, I have red and blue track pants, also from the Beckenbauer. This is just another worthy addition to the line. Now, why yellow? I have a lot of triple white or 
majority white shoes. I have a lot of triple black shoes, majority black shoes. If I'm gonna wear a shoe that's lacking in contrast, it's one solid color, or basically that color scheme, I need something else to pop. I like to pop, I like to snap, I like to crackle and pop and lock. That wasn't popping and locking, I realized that. So if I'm wearing like a triple black shoe, maybe I'm wearing the Haven Ultra Boost, I might wear these pants because I got black on my feet, bam! Like this yellow, maybe like a white t-shirt. It's all about the pants, baby. And then the pants draw the eye to the shoes. Same thing with the baby blues. I could wear a nice gray t-shirt. I could wear a white t-shirt. Wear these baby blue pants and it's like, pow! Draws my eye down to maybe an all gray shoe. Maybe it's the Beluga 2.0s, maybe it's the blue tits a triple white, whatnot. The way I think about it is this. If I'm gonna wear a loud shoe, lots of colors, maybe like the ice cream shoe, or maybe an ultra boost with greens and reds and yellows and purples and all that other stuff, I probably have to wear a more neutral pant, a white, a gray, a black, blue jean, okay? My feet are already gonna be loud, but if my feet aren't gonna be as loud, something else needs to scream from the rafters and draw your eye down. That's where these pants come in. Never done an on legs video. In fact, I don't know if I've ever seen one. Actually, I have. A lot of women on YouTube do fashion hauls. I think that's what this is, except it's track pants. So we're gonna put these track pants on leg. I'll throw on some shoes and let's figure out the best way to show it to you. Two things you need to know. Number one, there won't be any gratuitous crotch shots. It's just not gonna happen, married man. Number two, don't really have a butt. I know it, never had a butt. It does what it needs to. My wife, the girl is more than fine with it, gets the job done. Yeah, nope, nope, I'm just, um, don't got the spoiler back there. That does it for my first track pant street wear fashion video. Looking forward to doing a few more as we move along. Looking to get some shirts, some hats, some pants. I like stuff. Not all about the shoes, baby. Love shoes, love, love, love shoes. But you can't just walk out wearing shoes. Let me know in the comments down below what you think about these track pants. Which one do you like better? Give me a thumbs up. Let me know, hey, I like that video. You should do more. If you liked it a lot, maybe you hit that subscribe button. Do it for me. It's Wednesday. Subscribe Wednesday? Subscribe day? Thanks for watching. Stay tuned and just chill to the next episode.